is rattling. Welcome my friends, I'm Liz and with my friend she said I am inviting you to join our next adventure backpacking a few weeks on the Appalachian Trail. A lovely walk in the forest, I should say. 74 degrees or so. And it's probably what, one o'clock? What time do you think? One o'clock, I was right, 105. So, Tuesday and I are just enjoying this lovely, lovely, lovely walk. There's a little parking lot not too far from here. There's a parking lot not too far from here, she was there. I'm so happy, she, happy she's here with me or I'm here with her because it is nice to have that company. So, we probably did a mile, right? Oh, <laughs> uh, more than that. Oh, that's good news, more than a mile. <laughs> Next bank is a small stream. It's 1.7 miles ahead and it is almost completely downhill. Yeah, did you hear that? Downhill. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> We're delighted to have these bridges quite often, I might add. And as you can see, my friend, going up the hill, there is some climbing to be had. So far, everything has been uphill. But it's comfortable, y'all. I'm having a good time. I'll translate translate this for you. It says ranch chunk light tuna. That would be a lunch. So right now it's about 1.30. We got a two miles to go, a little bit more to get to camp to the shelter. So we're gonna stop for lunch because we're gonna get there too early. And uh, it is so nice out here, guys. I am so glad to be here. And uh, yeah, there's some, you know, steep places, but it's very short, steep places. So it's awesome. So, what do I eat for lunch? Well, glad you asked. Let me see. Seeds, fruits, and nuts, kind bar. And these are pretzels with peanut butter filling. It's kind of like my snack, lunch, kind of grace throughout the day, pretty much. I don't really uh, have a big meal lunch, per se. So, that's what we eat out here when we're backpacking. Yeah, yeah he's cute. And he's fat. Because he stopped rattling now. Okay, well, he thinks he doesn't see it. I'm glad he was rattling. I've never actually heard one up close before. All right, you guys. Rattlesnake. Yeah, we might have to wait for him to go. Well, you might have to throw a little stone by his side. Dude. You can move. You can, I mean, we might have to just wait for him, you know? Good luck with that. I thought that was cicadas up in the tree. No, I knew it was a rattler. I heard them before. I have never heard one before. But I had no before. idea. It was right next to your foot. <laughs> Very funny. Oh, oh, there it is. There you go. It's rattling. It heard me talking or laughing or something. I heard they don't even have ears. Shelter. No business shelter. And I'm going to sleep on that corner there. I did a little sweeping. Let me back away here so you can see. And there's the shelter with a table fire pit and we have cheese head back there putting on her hammock she's not gonna sleep in the shelter there's one other lady over there setting up her tent and that's it for now so we did five miles we brought four liters of water here because we don't think there's any water around so that should do it
this is exciting. It's the first time I ever set foot overnight in a shelter. I did see a shelter last year in uh, Shenandoah National Park when I was hiking around with my sister. So we did visit a shelter, but it's the first time I actually get to sleep in one. It's exciting. I feel like a newbie for sure. Good morning. Well, just left camp. Well, I had to leave the shelter. And that shelter was really, really nice. The people there were really nice. I slept in the shelter with one other fella and everybody else had their tents and hammock. And we had a lovely evening, great weather. Kind of warm, actually. It must have been the 50s. And my sleeping bag was a little warm. It's 20 degree bag or actually quilt. And uh, so today we're hiking six miles and we're getting to Uncle Johnny's where we are staying in and we're just walking right up to it. So we don't have to take a car or anything. So that's the plan for today. It is 10 after eight in the morning here on our local time. And um, what else can I tell you? We filming a little bit here and there down the trail. The fellows that I met were super nice. One thing I could tell you about the Appalachian Trail is well known for its great community, especially the through hikers. They developed families and were just friends. And we did meet a few of those that are hiking together. They all started in uh, Georgia, so it was nice to see the through hikers. There were six of us total, including us two. And we're the only two section hiking. She's head is still at camp. I started walking without her for a little bit because I'm a, I'm a little slower than she is. She's been out here in the trail for some time now. And so she's stronger and uh, and I haven't done anything, so I'm slow as molasses, but a mile an hour. It'll take me six hours to get to Uncle Johnny's, so that's fine. Because the temperature is great and everything is wonderful. All right, so I'll uh, talk to you at some point later on. Happy trails! Well, thanks for coming along with me on this beautiful day. Um, now at the cabin, relaxing, and got the air conditioning on, I'm getting ready for a hot shower. Oh yeah, life is great. It's about 2.30 in the afternoon, and uh, the last time I filmed anything was on top of the view of the river and the bridge. Wasn't that beautiful? I just love that. And, uh, but my legs are pretty shot from going downhill, but anyway, still you know it um, took me a little longer than the rest of the crew but I'm here yay 2 30 so let's go take a shower and uh, and have another beer yay